time to let go, time to touch base with that inner room, that inner sanctum within you, within each and every one of us. You know, I, I, before we start, I found a, uh, from a, a clip from a Buddhist teaching, an excerpt, I should say, and it said, when we begin to feel the benefits of meditation practice, it is like putting on glasses for the first time. Once we learn to sit with the breath, to be present in the moment, and create space between ourselves and our thoughts, our lives come into focus and we awaken to the possibility of something else. The elevation, the alleviation of suffering. So just take an easy breath in and think about that. How important meditation can be in your life. And you cannot do it wrong. So just stay with us. If you're a person who believes, I don't know how to meditate, I need to take a class. No, you don't. It's just getting quiet and just being in the silence and being with the guided visualization that we do every Sunday. So take a nice, easy breath in, breathing in the daily word, peace. Breathe that in to your solar plexus. And with the exhale, let go of anything that's telling you anything different other than peace. Let it go. So as you take one more breath in, Nice and easy. And then exhale, letting go. Letting go. For the daily word was all about peace. And how do we bring peace into our lives? So I'd like to encourage you right now, as often I do, and that is to use the power of your imagination and go to a place where you feel safe in your mind's eye. And this place can be a real place, a place in your home, or a place that you've been to, your favorite chair. It can be a place you've already been on a, on a beach or up on a mountain. But through the power of our imagination, we can bring any kind of background into our imagination of an area where we feel safe. For me, I tend to go to the woods. For others, I know there is sitting by the water or in a garden of flowers. There's no wrong way, no wrong way to create your safe place. So just stay with that safe place in your mind's eye as we go through this meditation time together. So I want you to just take an easy breath in now, not a deep one, just an easy breath. Follow your breath in to your lungs and then follow that breath out with the exhale. Today is your time to go into the silence. Jesus called it the upper room where he would go. To above that mind. And to seek the higher consciousness that we just talked about. Seek a higher consciousness. A state of peacefulness. And know that God is always there.
So for a moment, I invite you to consider taking something maybe that's been heavy on your mind today. I know there were quite a few of us that were dealing with lots of situations this morning, just here in the sanctuary, getting ready for service. And to watch how each and every one of us kept moving to claiming divine order. So I invite you to think about what's been going on in your world. Maybe this morning, or maybe it's something that you've listened to or seen on the news that's got you a little troubled, or maybe a lot troubled. It's okay, remember, you're in your safe place. There is nothing or no one can harm you here. I just invite you to just bring that into your mind's eye. And now I ask you to seek a higher consciousness of whatever that situation or thing may be, or maybe it's a person. And I want you to just imagine yourself floating above that situation. Seek that higher consciousness. See yourself elevating from this room right now. And now even seek higher to elevate above this building and to elevate higher and higher to where these things that you've brought to your mind that are disrupting your peace, that they look so small from way up here. Just notice in the quiet of your mind and in your heart how small that particular situation, or maybe you brought situations into your mind, how small they look from a higher plane, from a higher consciousness. In the quiet and in the silence of your mind right now. Just take a look at how small it looks from way up there. Notice how peaceful things seem from a higher state of consciousness. Doesn't change that there's a situation or something that's disruptive. Doesn't change, there's that there. But when we see the spiritual truth of how in a larger scale we have the power to not let it hook us. Seek that higher consciousness, a state of peacefulness, and know that God is always, always there. So take an easy breath in. And then with the exhale, know how supported and loved you are by God the good omnipotence. as you slowly start to bring yourself back down into this space, into this sanctuary. You're okay. This is how we create a change. By allowing ourselves to stop, to meditate for just a moment, 
seek that higher consciousness and rise above the situation. And trust me, a change will come. So now take another easy breath in. And this breath is bringing your awareness back to this space. Wiggle your fingers a little bit. And if your eyes were closed, just gently open them whenever you're ready. As we get to hear a beautiful song by Angie. 